that first episode was pretty good, man. The whole setup of like, you know, we're just out here chilling, even though no one cares. And uh, our current head is just drugged up and just not even there. He's basically Joe Biden. Everything's going to be fine. It's like everything's not going to be fine. That Giga Chat guy, what was his name? Takago or something? Dude, the guy that backstabbed us, I, I know what he did was bad. But something about his eyes, the way that he sees the world, it's kind of crazy. It's actually very compelling. Takauji, right? Like, he's got this crazy look in his eyes and thinking, well, who's going to stop me? I'm like the chosen one. And he, honestly, he might be the chosen one. But our boy's going to be the Lord of War in two years. Gojo Satoru has showed up out of nowhere as a fraud, quack, prophecy guy. He does have future sight, though. He dodged all those, you know, arrows. And he just starts mumbling about like, oh, if I did this, then I can't spoil this. And there's some funny stuff like that. But it does look like he has some kind of future sight. He he knew this shit was going to happen. He saved the young lord, even throw him down to give him like some kind of result. Because like the young lord was like, I don't want to live. And he was like, all right, bet. Push Rachel style. And then he was like, actually, I do want to live. And it's like, all right, bet. Now we're going to go around for this two years and do training arc and find other people and then get revenge. Let's get let's begin today's reaction. Mm. That heartbeat, bro. <laughs> Oh, this was the um arranged marriage girl, right? Was it not? Or someone else? No, I forget. There was a girl that was supposed to be arranged marriage to the main character. Who is this guy? He's the brother? Can we get out there? Good luck, this guy's so honorable. Trust nobody. Trust nobody in this show. Tower God style. What the what's fuck? It? Is that just imagery? What's it? Wait, 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 wait. This isn't like some sort of like different character, evil character, right? Like this is just imagery of him being like a demon. Betraying, you know, the brother, right? Is there any deeper meaning here of him just like flicking his tongue and everything, you know, going up in like ghost spirit? I'm just going to assume that it's just imagery. What's it? Yo, what that tongue doing, bro? Yo, this POV running animation. Oh, this must be a nightmare. Hello. This face is actually perfect thumbnail content, bro. It's so good. Ew! Your face when you're asleep is so sweet, I could eat you up. And, listen. For whatever reason, this anime went viral on Twitter. Have you seen that post? The Japanese tweets. Have you seen that shit? Of all the reasons for this anime to go viral, not the, not the betrayal plot, not the amazing animation, but like, there was a sus scene of, you know, Tokyuki-sama on Gojo Satoru's lap, and he, he, his, her, his face was all like panting and like blushing. And that, that went viral. I'm like, you fucking degenerates. I guess it's nice that the anime get more visibility that way. But like, yeah. The Shotokan moment just went viral. Wake up prank? Alright, sure. The dog is very funny. あなたの領地で囲まってくれるといいながらもうな。それは鎌倉からの出口に思っていたより厳重に兵が敷かれておりまして、もうしばらくの我慢かと。We like, it's not just me, right? When you look into those eyes, it's kind of scary. Because he's always kind of just like 
smiling. And these eyes, the more I look deeper into it, it's like the abyss. His eyes just represent just lunacy levels of passion and like determination and an ambition for power. Yeah. His face is, it's something about him. I look at him, it's just like scary. Man on a mission. What did you just say? Cheer up, she said. Oh, okay. That's what the new drip is. Got it. あの、鬼ごっこで天下を取り返せと言いました。鬼ごっこで取れる天下など聞いたことがない。But we're in and we're out. Bye bye. Bro's not fucking around. Running away. Round two. Damn. Oh, it's a Everything is just burnt down. Is that the brother? Dad. Was that, was that dad or dad? I'm going to assume it's the brother. I know he's a kid. It's a 10 year old kid. What did you expect from a 10 year old kid hearing that his brother's head got cut off? It makes sense. Huh? They didn't even recognize his face. We, we could have gotten away. And then he also says, my brother. あ。<笑><笑> Yeah, let's not get it, let him get away. Let's get the uncle before we get out of here. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. He got a trophy. A little bit of historical lesson for us. The man went on to become one of the most brutal warlords in Japanese history. A man that sacrificed his quote unquote kid. I think it was like his sister's kid or something, right? He's an uncle, but like he got a trophy, bro. He's a fucking demon. He got a trophy for that shit. <laughs> That's actually pretty funny. <laughs> Can we even trust Yoshirige then? I think we can, but can he? I don't know. Our, our old boy is not going to have to trust issues anymore. Wait! In episode one! Y'all remember? Before everything went bad, there was a ball falling down, and then it transitioned to the head? Yeah, and that was his brother's head? Whoa! You, you can trust get though. He's a little sus, but, you know. <laughs> You gotta stop doing that shit. You gotta, I'm trying to, I was really immersed at that. Boom! And with the fucking lights every time too. He's like a clown trying to make us happy out of this. I don't know. Yes, yes. In the future site. Oh, 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 in the future site. Cut his head off! <laughs> but he went on to become a warlord in Japanese history. 
But this show doesn't need to be consistent with Japanese history. So he can still die, right? It's not like the uncle's just gonna live just because in history he went on to become like a ruthless warlord, right? I think they can take some uh, leeways with the story and kind of follow the formula. Not nitty gritty though. Like not every detail needs to be correct. Just kind of similar. These people are there, but he can probably die here now, right? Naraba. Alright. We're playing tag again? First step, I like it. Let's take out the uncle. What a traitor. Wait, wait, wait. wait. What happened to him? Yo, he's a beggar now. After he betrayed, he also got ditched. <laughs> Then you better get the real one. <laughs> I need to roll higher numbers. Oh, that's not good. He's gone absolutely crazy, dude. You see, you walk in the fucking streets and you see a guy like this doing this shit. It's like, don't make eye contact. Don't pull aggro from this hostile NPC. <laughs> what the fuck? What, what? The daughter is low-key so cunny. The daughter, she got a little fake-ass tree hat too. I wonder if there's any purpose to the daughter other than just being a mascot. Because she's just cute so far. But like, what can she do? <laughs> oh shit, he is actually playing into an Oni. Love this animation though. Alright, today we're just scouting. Katakuchika Oh, yeah, that's right. He has no Producer, dude, Monopoly just ruins friendships, bro. You don't play Monopoly when you're trying to make friends. Monopoly is when all the betrayals happen. Monopoly is when you realize who the real people are in your life. Oh, okay. Are they strong? What are they good at? Okay. We're just recruiting a bunch of 10 year olds, bro. Is. <laughs> Is that all we have? Just a legion of 10-year-old kids to take down the next fucking Shogun? Like, damn, bro. <laughs> what the I've been calling him Yoshi to get the entire time. It's Yorishige. My dyslexia is out of control. Yorishige. Mm. Arms and legs. Look at that sun. Takauji. Give me Takauji. I want to see him, bro. So, Tokyuki sama. Huh? Oh, Katana. How does she know? She also has foresight like her father, then? Is that what's implied here? Because again, I was asking, like, what is her purpose? What is her function other than mascot? She could kind of feel it, right? Woman's intuition, or is it foresight? Right? <laughs> this is actually so good, but like, does it cost less money to animate like this? Because the like, guy I was going to say, this is a really cool way to show how much he's just becoming more like a demon, right? The imagery from before, but at the same time, save money on the animation quality, right? 
So like, I actually don't think that this is being lazy. This is like a this is like an instance where lazy animation can be used to portray that he is just losing all sense of humanity while saving money. <laughs> Bro's going crazy. There he is. This anime is not gonna beat the allegations. <laughs> this anime is not gonna beat the. This is the guy that tweeted that tweet, by the way, in episode one. This is the guy that tweeted. There's a Japanese tweet, and if you click translate, <laughs> you do not want to read what it says, dude. <laughs> Oscar winning acting though. Wow, this guy is in it. He's just like method acting. Yorishige said him up. Yeah. What? Yo! I thought he was a drunk idiot! He reacted to that? What? なるほど。<笑><笑> Oh shit, he was fighting the sword. How's he talking right now? Sam told you ass looking ass. Whoa. <laughs> I love it. Okay, you know what? The uncle, maybe I was disrespecting him. I thought he was a random ass dude, but he's like, you know what? I got this job. And then perfectly timed with the tree falling on. Because I am Tsuyoi, that's name. <laughs> Always, I'll never not laugh at just kids just getting brutalized in anime. This is just so funny. This 10 year old kid trying to fight a grown ass man just gets punched, hilt to the fucking side of the head. <laughs> Again, stop saying this shit. Stop, 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 stop. Wait, why, why are you saying shit like stop trying to fucking delay this? Your brother didn't even put up a fight. Like, again, this anime is not fucking being the allegations, bro. Like, stop with the sussy ass dialogue. <laughs> Oh, Lord oh, shit. What? That's what happened? They didn't even take him away. He did all this shit to it. Make him even worse. Take him away. Take him away. Take Fight back! <laughs> Someone's gonna fucking take a screenshot of this and make a tweet of it too. Someone's gonna do it. Mark my words. Somebody is gonna do the same shit like in episode one and they're gonna take the screen, bro. <laughs> what? No, there's a deeper meaning, right? He's like gonna be like, no, nah, he needs to solve it himself, and when he's alone to the last stand, then his true self will show. Again, sing. He's, sing. he's adapting to the movement. Yes, with every dodge, 
it gets more sus. He starts to blush more. For whatever reason, this really turns him off. The elusive samurai! Okay. The wings. Oh. Got it. Yeah, the, this was the person that I thought it was. I thought the brother was the uh, the the uh, the other girl that's supposed to be engaged to. She's dead too, right? She's just like no longer here anymore, right? Yeah, I think she's gone, right? But now, his limbs are off. He's just having fun. Maybe. Yeah, these two are like ride or die. Dude, the daughter is so cunning. The daughter is just like... Yes! So basically the formula is like he is weak as shit but you can just dodge and make the opportunity for the other two to attack because those are you know his legs and arms as Yorishige said <laughs> The eye technique <laughs> Game of tag never gonna end Get his ass! Kick to the ass! Nice throw! The speed is power, though, isn't it? What are you doing? <laughs> so, even though he's weak as shit, obviously speed is power, right? When he's going this speed, when he's dropping down like this, he can cut too. But the fight is, he's going to be elusive. He's going to be making the opportunities for the other two to do something. And sometimes, you know, we can also cut too. <laughs> that ball. See that ball? The ball from the rooftop again. The, the, the same ball. But this time, it's the other, it's the uncle's head. Because before it was the brother's head, right? But, you know, the ball scene was the brother's head before, but now it's the uncle's head. And then the ball animation continues. Where <laughs> I guess this is a nice way to give closure on the big bro uh, situation, huh? The and that is today's episode of Elusive Samurai. And the pacing is amazing, bro. Like, yo, episode one went crazy. Episode two also went crazy. What is the, uh, what did we learn today? Uncle's a piece of shit. Everybody has just been betraying us. And big bro gets betrayed by uncle and like, that's it. What the fuck? The uncle's a very adaptive person. Apparently he went on to be the most, you know, uh, ruthless warlords ever in Japanese history. But this is an anime. It doesn't really have to follow historical lessons direct one-to-one. -one, so they're going to kill him now. Honestly, the uncle's facial animations, the demonic way, the imagery, the different types of animation to show how demonic he's becoming. It was pretty peak. And like, I didn't even realize that he could be so strong. I thought he was just like a random dude that's uh, just selling out everybody. But the moment that he blocked the kids' attacks, pretty crazy. Talking about the other kids, I don't really know enough about them, right? But they basically come from a family background that serves somehow up to the Hojo family. So they're, they're here to just ride or die for us. And now we've collected a party of like roughly 10-year-old kids who's going to overthrow Takauji. If, it's pretty hard to believe that, but looking at how strong or how elusive Tokyuki is, 
maybe there's a different way to fight, right? You don't have to fight directly head on. The whole theme of the fights are like a game of tag. So I'm sure by being deceptive and being elusive, we're able to overthrow Takauji in our own way. And some beautiful ways of doing like a callback to the ball falling scene from last episode with their older brother's head falling off. And then, you know, that head that becomes the uncle. And then we continue the final scene of what the conversation was with the brother and him saying that you can do it. A little bit of closure for us, and that's it for us. If you're still here, if you didn't use this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for more content. And until next time, take care.